And here we go, finally, the Dallas Mavericks get on the board, signing a free agent this offseason. And let's read what Adam Schefter tweeted out. Another change of heart after agreeing to a deal with the 49ers, former Chargers and Vikings linebacker Eric Kendricks has decided to go to the Dallas Cowboys instead. Mike Zimmer wanted Kendrick to help his run defense and Kendrick's actually preferred to play in Dallas and with the acquisition of Eric Kendrick's the Dallas Cowboys are finally on the 2024 free agent scoreboard and this is actually a very good signing in this video we're going to break down everything that eric kendricks brings to dallas but also before we get into that do me a favor and comment down below a letter grade for this signing the first signing what would you give it as a letter grade and also subscribe if you knew more videos for the cowboys coming out soon but let's get right into it now, the first thing I notice when I watch Eric Kendrick's plays is he is a phenomenal run stopper. I mean, let me just slow this down so you guys can really, uh, you know, get the full look at Eric Kendrick's. But when you look at the man's career so far, he has had only one season without 100 tackles. And that was his rookie year. He put up 92. Since then, 100 tackles every single season. This year, with a uh la chargers he had 117 tackles 79 of those are solo but also had three and a half sacks one forced fumble and was absolutely amazing uh deflecting six passes being in on nine run stuffs as well eric kendricks is a monster right but when you look at the dallas cowboys right now they were ranking last season number 18 in rush yards allowed per game number 16 in yards allowed per rush and number 17 or, or excuse me 23 in rushing touchdowns allowed per game this man right here eric kendricks is going to be a phenomenal addition here in dallas and honestly this is such an unbelievable first addition to their team right the first free agent signing eric kendricks now i know he is getting up there in age he is 32 years old but like i said he has only had one season without 100 tackles. This this boy, Eric Kendricks, is a dog, and I don't think it's really too hard to know, right? Now, also, when we look at their depth chart, when you look at their team, right, this defense looks really, really talented on paper. They are ranking top 10 in uh, points a lot per game last season. You got Demarcus Lawrence, Mozzie Smith, who they think highly of, right? They think he's going to take a major jump up. You still have Michael Parsons, who's a beast. Then you have Lane Vanderish and Damone Clark, right? Those two guys are your top two linebackers. From there, it gets a little dicey, right? They like Marquise Bell a little bit. He looked pretty decent uh, for the majority of last season. You have DeMarvion, uh, DeMarvion Overshone, who they drafted in the third round as well. But now you just have a new dynamic here in Eric Kendricks, right? If anyone has to miss some time, now you have not only great depth, but you have a guy that can start every single game this season in Eric Kendricks. A leader, a locker room guy who everyone wants to play with. This is such a good addition. Not only that, but you get back Trayvon Diggs. You have Deron Bland, two of the biggest playmakers in the NFL last season. Well, Deron Bland last season, the year before that, Trayvon Diggs. These guys are insane at reading routes, jumping passes, and getting interceptions. Eric Kendricks, this man right here is going to fit perfectly in this team, right? Over his career, over 1,000 tackles, right? Over 650 of those were solo. 18 and a half sacks, five forced fumbles, six fumble recoveries, nine interceptions to go along with 57 pass deflections and 57 run stuffs as well. So not only can you play this guy um, as a linebacker to stop the run, which obviously we, we I told you the stats, they need help stopping the run, right? Not only can he do that, he can drop back into his own coverage and pl play a role there. He can get to the quarterback if you need him to in that double mug look, get him going up the middle. He'll get to the quarterback relatively quickly. This is such a good signing. I don't even know what else to say. Now, let me know in the comments down below, what do you think this team, this uh, Cowboys team needs to do next in terms of free agency, if anything? But if not, what do you think or who should they be looking at in the NFL draft? if um or what position should they be looking at with that being said guys hit the like button subscribe if you're new join the family i am so excited to see what eric kendrick does here in uh dallas